Hello followers of my world. Um, I realised the other day it's been a long time since I've made a video and there's been a lot of shit changed but I don't know what I've shown you before I changed it basically so I'm going to show you round again and this will be another quick look. Here's our recent uh, recent edition, Bernard, the wee lady kitten and we have uh, yeah on the outside as you can see I've put that big massive rope that was on the front, replaced that with all my other rubbish that I'm yet to get rid of but Put all my rope around the edge of the boat so it looks smarter. Put in some little rope handrails on the top. And I've put in a new little flag thing, it's all lovely. And then what have we got? We've got a new newly painted hatch on the front up here. Ah, Tom, Jeff, Alex and Bernard. But it seems Alex can't spell Bernard. Never mind. But yeah, we've got new neck curtains in the bedroom. Red stars and cow print in the sitting room. And here we have the newest thing, like last time I showed you in HD, I was showing you the roof. Well, we've gone and done a new roof, this one here. I mean, it's already covered in stuff, but it's basically, I've canvassed it with an old gazebo roof. And then pulled the bits down the side. So I have fly sheets like this. That looks actually quite spanky and neat. Right, out on the back deck, what have we got? We have got on the ends on the back deck. We've got all, all my electrics are now wired in. And let's see all this regulators and jazz and all going on. Oh, and the engine works now. I don't know whether it worked last time I spoke to you, but yeah, it worked. Works all fine. All my battery storage. Just sorted out the gear the gearbox. So I've now got reverse. This is my new fridge. I did have a fridge temporarily, but the temp fridge, the new fridge was awful. So I decided to throw it away and replace it with a cool box that I'm going to put a little fan in up there somewhere and you've got all around the back deck here my new poof, my steering yep, I've, where I fixed the engine the rudder fell off so now I've made a makeshift tiller this is Mark II that's all the big bench seat across the back and this is some new carpet for the back for the inside, sorry we've even got my golf clubs on here logs, spare insulation and all that stuff right, then we come into the, into the main room and we've got all all new and sorted out in here. For instance, the roof is now completely painted. The hole for the fire is there and ready. All the curtains have been hung. There goes Bernard down the gunnels. But we've got the TV there. Big old bed with more cow print curtains. As you can see, we've got new floor under the table. All of this is one piece of foam with the vent for the engine, the, um, the air intake all sorted out. And then we've got a DVD with a shelf on this side. Was large made that slightly larger so I could get DVDs on it and then all my spirit spirit counters and everything still there all my electrics got electrics down here as well now um, what is it all of this is all cleaned through and that's just tool storage now and then we have all of this in here which isn't too new it's more the fact that the curtains have been put in the bed has been lowered because I've taken out all the excess foam I didn't need but as you can see it's all a bit bit roomier in here, have a quick look round, if I come from this side and then you can sort of see what I, what I mean when I say I mean, we've got lights up here and light up there we've got more red starry curtains in here but you can see what I mean by the boat does actually seem quite big from here I know it's not big and by no stretch of the imagination is it actually a huge boat but it's a very, it's livable I can live on it basically, uh, but yes, I thought I'd do a quick little show just to see what's going on. I'm just trying to think what else I've done, but there's not enough. It's all things that, you, that should have worked before, but now I've basically gone round and put things up. It's stuff like changing the curtain poles from polyplum to actual curtain uh, wire, so stuff like that. But yes, it's all looking much smarter and much, much neater. So I apologise for all the people that I've been ignoring for the last couple of months because my life has been men mental trying to get this boat ready for winter. And other than painting the gunnels and what was it? painting the gunnels and putting a fire in, I'm all done. I'm up to speed. So hopefully I'll speak to some of you soon and I'll actually get out of the boat and catch up. Enjoy.